Today I'll be showing you how to mod, soft mod, a Nintendo Wii with firmware version 4.1U. You will also need at least a 2 gig SD card. Okay, download the files. That will be in the description link. I just downloaded all of them and put them on my desktop. Now, to make this process easier, we'll click on the first part. And they are in a zip file, so you will have to extract them. I use 7-zip. Okay, go to extracts. And I'm just going to extract them on the desktop, and I'm going to name this one part 1. Press enter. Go ahead and close that out. Okay, now we'll do part 2. Go ahead and extract that. We'll call this part 2. Go ahead and extract them. Okay, now for Dark Corp here. Go ahead and extract this one to part two because it'll just make it easier for future steps. Okay, and then finally part three. Extract that. Okay, now that we have all those done, we will go to computer. And format the flash drive. And it has to be in FAT32. And I just do a quick format. So just go ahead and start that. It'll take just a second. And now we're done. And go ahead and copy the files from part one onto the SD card. And I'm going to cut them off. Paste them there. And once this is done copying, go ahead and throw them, throw the SD card into your Wii. Okay, we have our SD card in the Wii. Now we will go to the Wii options data management channels go to the SD card give this a minute to load up and yes okay now we will go to the WAD manager press 1 Press A. Now both of these should install, but I have done this to mine a couple times before, so that first one never installs for me. Yours should say, two successfully completed. Okay, now we back out. Go to the App Manager. And install HackMe. Okay, it's going to pop up here. We're going to press 1 in a second. Okay, there we go. 
And now we go up to we continue. So just press A. And then go up to install homebrew channel. Press A. Go to yes. Now it's installing the homebrew channel. Continue. Successful. Now go to boot me. Install an iOS. Can go to yes. Go to yes. Okay. Now that that is done, we now have the homebrew channel installed. Now we move on to part two. Remove the SD card and continue. All right. Now that we have that part done, we will put the SD card back in and format it again. Okay. Close it and now we will open part two and simply select everything in here. Right click, cut, go back to the computer and paste it on your SD card for part two. Okay, now that this is done, we can go ahead and take the SD card out right about now. Okay, go ahead and take the SD card out and put in the Wii to uh, continue part two. Alright, as you can see, the homebrew channel is installed, so insert your SD card for part two. And then click on the homebrew channel, go down to start. If you're still in the homebrew channel, that's fine. You can just throw your SD card and it'll load it. Okay, from here we will now press the home button. Go to launch boot me. That will pop up. A couple more things will pop up. Okay, now you go to WAD manager. Press 1, press A, okay, now it is installing one of 43 items. Now it should successfully install all of these and I will show you when it's done but I'm going to pause it now because this will take you a little while.